Hello viewers, this is your evil twin welcoming you back to Let's Play Wolfenstein. The last episode ended with my unfortunate demise at the blades of a Veil vale assassin, but I'll be ready for him this time. What? He's here. Can't, can't use my Veil powers to see him due to the inhibitor. Ah, gotcha. Can't believe that guy managed to surprise me twice. Previously, he attacked me in the room up ahead, so uh, didn't expect him out here. Oh, look at that! The uh, outfits for the assassins. I fought three of them so far, and there's, um, there's three missing. So, the Tesla gun. It was originally in Return to Castle Wolfenstein as a reward for defeating the super soldier boss fight at the end of the X-Labs. It was quite an interesting weapon because you didn't need to aim it. It fired several streams of electricity that would automatically arc towards enemies. The problem is that it didn't do very much damage. Uh, it was pretty similar to the submachine gun. It was ideal for fighting large groups of weak enemies but problematic against tougher enemies like black guards and elite guards and so on. You could get away with it sometimes if you had quite a bit of health and armour, but if you were in some difficulty, if you had low health, then you were better off trying to snipe the enemies um, or, to, uh, or to mince them up with a venom gun. There's also the fact that um, the electricity was a bit unreliable because as well as arcing towards enemies, it sometimes liked to, um, to arc towards objects. So if there were obstacles in the way or if it was quite a tight corridor or cave or something, then you could end up uh, you know, zapping objects or zapping the walls rather than zapping an enemy. The electricity did have a bit of a stun effect, but only briefly. So uh, against tough enemies, they would be paralysed for like half a second, but then they would recover and they would open fire on you. And again, with black guards, that was a big problem because they were armed with a powerful uh, paratrooper rifle. Yeah, I really don't know what the what the, their thinking was behind giving that weapon to you so so late in the game and having all the enemies be tough enemies. Uh, it was. Um, you know, the only reason to actually use the weapon was for fun. It was it was just really cool seeing all the arcs of electricity all over the place. But in terms of combat and tactics, it was um, it usually wasn't the best option. If you uh, if you decide to play the game using cheats and give yourself the Tesla gun earlier in the game, then it's fantastic because the enemies have got much lower health and the, the brief stun period lasts for about the same amount of time that it takes to kill an ordinary soldier. So you can just run through the levels, uh, electrocuting everyone, and it's rare that they'll get to fire a shot in response. And uh, it's also quite ammo efficient. Every couple of levels I'd have to use a cheat code to, um, you know, to refill my Tesla ammo. Um, but yeah, I was able to play through about half the game in, in just an hour. And uh, yeah, it was crazy fun. Now, fortunately, the Tesla gun in Wolfenstein 2009 is an improved model. It does uh, rather more damage, and it has a really good stun effect, which you know, is really effective at paralysing enemies. You can tell it's an improved model because, although it has a very similar design, uh, it actually has four spinny bits rather than three, and four is obviously better than three. It also has an actual model number, it says TSL43 on the side. There's a few things in the game that suggest the year is supposed to be 1944, so I guess this technology is at least half a year old. And apparently it has a name, the Blitzschlag, which means lightning strike. I'm not quite sure where that's written in the game though. But yeah, to, because it is um, you know, rather more powerful, they gave it some new drawbacks. Um, the spinny bits only spin you know, when you press the trigger, so uh, it actually has a spin-up time uh, like a minigun or the particle cannon. And also they reduced its range, so it's strictly a close-range weapon. Um, but um, you know, but it, is, it is very effective at what it does, and uh, let's have some fun um, giving it a try.
Did you hear that? Mein Lieben! <laughs> oh, brilliant! <laughs> That's a, a death cry from, um, from old Wolfenstein 3D. Oh, we're getting really retro now. Ah, oh, that is satisfying. Yeah, when making my mod, I did increase the damage of the Tesla gun to compensate for the increased enemy health. So, um, yeah, it's just as effective as in a normal game. Oh, you see that? I zapped him slightly, and it stunned him. What's handy is that when there's a blackout, the enemies can't see me in the dark. I hear that you've been having some electrical problems! Time to dance the electric boogaloo! Let the juice flow! Don't worry, I'm here to light things up. Pow! Oh, I love the way it just throws them across the room. Oh, they've gotten the lights back on. Oh. Well, you know what that means, don't you? I'm going to have to electrocute them all over again! Aha! date with current affairs. I feel like there's a real connection between us. Ground yourselves! Need a jump? I'll connect all of you at once, and no extra charge! Lights out! You should try to think a little more positively. Surging forward! Got juice? Like a Christmas tree! I'm conserving energy! Let's make contact! Time for a shocker! Let's light them up! Extra crispy! You know a gun's good when you can have fun firing at inanimate objects. Although I seem to be animating this one. It's alive! <laughs> it's alive! But not you. Stunning behavior. Fear me, for I am the oncoming storm. Charge! Resistance is useless. And so is insulation. Just go with the flow.
Here's your electric bell. Funnily enough, I'm feeling pretty wired. That's what I like to see. Two sacks full of gold. Yes, I've still got lots of ammo for the Tesla gun. Uh, it's very ammo efficient. But, uh, it is rare though. Um, there aren't any enemies that carry the Tesla gun. But the, um, but the batteries that you do get um, go a long way. Uh, looks like we've entered the morgue. That sparks my interest. Hey, don't be so negative. No, don't worry. Everything's quiet around here. Stand up and fight you, coward. They're giving me static. Jeez, tough crowd. Is it something I said? That's right, Nazis. Evil doers like you will ride the lightning. I hope that you filled in your last will and testament. Twenty-three out of twenty-three gold. Hmm. Ah, I suppose it is a morgue. Frequencies has proven much harder than we had thought. Every test subject that passes through the portal still returns to us altered. My God, it's the spy! You must protect me! Nein, Herr Doctor. You will be the one who protects me! Oh, you will witness just how power the Nazi army is destined to be Boss fight. That's what you get for standing around making speeches. I guess he didn't realise the creature was going to come through the portal quite so soon. This monstrosity is known as the Altered. And he's bulletproof. The only weapon that has any effect on him is the Tesla gun. It stuns him. Handily, the Nazis will give him their undivided attention. Keep 
Ooh. Well, he will go after whoever seems is pissing him off the most at the moment. Ah, he tore him in half! Oh, I could watch this all day. Whoop. Now that's the trick, you see. Can't hurt him directly. If you annoy him, you can get him to smash the pillars, and in the process, smash the portal. Um. Where do you think you're going? Whoa! Go. Ooh, that was close. Ah! Oh, one left. There we go. Got him. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, um. Uh oh. No! Oh my god! Ah! Just had a little visit to the Black Sun dimension. And here is our reward. A new veil power. M power. Increases weapon damage. And it makes your gun growl like a wild animal. And it lets you shoot through shields. These are SS Nazis, and my modifications to the game make them super tough. Uh, I should need four assault rifle bullets to kill them, but with Empower I'm killing them with just two bullets. And later in the game you can upgrade Empower and make it even more powerful. Oh, I love those sounds. Another tome of power. Yes, when using in power. Leave these uh, orange molten marks in the walls. And uh, yeah, you can shoot through uh, thin surfaces. Yeah, squads of Nazis now start using these portable shield generators, which means that Empower will be very useful.
I agreed to go on a mission for the Golden Dawn and investigate a hospital the Nazis had recently taken over. But I found surprised even me. They started using mechanical augmentations to create invisible assassins. I also found that stone portal I'd seen at the dig site. It's a gateway to the Black Sun Dimension and mutates men into monsters. I disrupted their work, but I don't think I completely destroyed the portal. All the gold, intel, and tomes. Thousand dollar reward. And most used weapon, Tesla gun. Hell yeah. Nice to see. Is that uh, already? I've got some upgrades available for the Tesla gun. Uh, I look forward to putting them into action. Join me for the next episode of Let's Play Wolfenstein, where we'll be exploring this war-torn part of town, encountering some dangerous new enemies, buying some funky new upgrades, and attacking SS Headquarters.